Hi everyone and welcome to this video. In this video I'm just going to really simply show you how to add the new WordPress hosting package to an existing Fastface account. So I'm on the main uh, Fastface website here and we're just going to go to login there and you want to log into the control panel. Just use your usual username and password. Uh, it's quite normally an email address there. And going to go over to the WordPress hosting section here. Now I have previously added some, uh, so you might be seeing slightly different here, uh, but this button will be here regardless at a WordPress website. Um, once this screen's loaded, uh, we have a few options, not too many, so we can add as many websites as you want. We're not going to be adding domain names at this section, um, so don't worry if you haven't got the domain names ready to go. If you're going to be buying more than one, you can just add it here. So I'm just going to add one at this time, but we can uh, use that to change the number, and that will affect your pricing as well. And contracts, you've got a couple of options there, so you can pay monthly or pay yearly. And continue. Now, once this goes through to the next stage, it's just going to be the uh, the uh, the checkout. Again, we're not doing anything here. Uh, it's a separate video to actually set up the package. We're just simply adding the package to our account. So check the checkout details, payment methods, and we have to agree to the terms and conditions and fastest terms and conditions. Uh, confirm and pay now. And that's going to go through and confirm that order. It's usually pretty quick. Might have to just pause the video here. It can take up to a couple of minutes, but oh, no, don't even have to pause. Look at that. Done. So we're going to a different video now, the actual setup process, but the package has been added to your account now and you're ready to start the setup process. If you go through to that setup, your WordPress website here, you're going to be starting the setup, uh, setup process. If you've gone to setup later, we'll just go back to the control panel and the rest will be covered in another video and that's all there is to it thanks very much for watching goodbye for now